Hi, this is Patrick. In this video, I'm going to show you how to do some basic changes to the layout of Dreamweaver. So whether you're installing it for the first time or whether you want to change some things, this might help. Now I'm going to show you just the way that I like it laid out. This might not be the same for everyone. So I tend to like to work in appear into standard rather than developer. If you like to do a lot of hand coding, you might find you like developer better. I can also, if it ever gets funky, I can reset standard back to the normal mode. And so by default, I like to have the files panel on the right over here. And so I can always make this smaller. But if for some reason I find that, you know, the files panel is gone, I can come back over here to window and I can find files and I can add it back. So once I'm in this view, if I open a new HTML file, up here, I tend to like to work in design mode rather than live. Over time, I think Dreamweaver is going to do a better job with live mode. Live mode is supposed to mimic more what you would see in a browser, but I find that it's kind of clunky and it doesn't work well for me. I also like to work in split mode. Now, Dreamweaver used to, years ago, recommend this split mode. Then they changed it, and I got used to the new way they did it. Now they've gone back. So but I got so used to having my code view on the left, I like to change this. So I go over here and I can go to view mode or split mode up here. In split mode, I like to split vertically. I like my code on the left. So this is how I like it. The other thing I like is I like the properties inspector. I think they just call it properties now at the very bottom. So I take this and I drag it down. If I hold it just right, it will dock. Now I can later add other things if I'm, you know, validating. If I'm doing other things, I can and I can add them down here below this properties inspector or above it. I can also, you know, take a number of these things and then undock them. But this gives you the basic look of how I like to set up my folder. So. And then the next thing I do is I try to, when I'm brand new, is I try to set up my file structure. So I really address that more in videos when we talk about FTP, but hopefully this helps you see the basics of how to set up the windows and the code view in Dreamweaver. Thanks.